ஸ்டேட்ஸ் ஜாவா ஃபார் செலீனியம் சி வி கேன் செக்ரிகேட் ஜாவா ஃபார் செலீனியம் இன்டு டூ கேட்டகரிஸ் ஆ தல்மே சுப்ரியா ஜாவா மெத்தட்ஸ் we can segregate java for selenium into two categories one is java fundamentals or basics another is java fundamentals or basics another is you continue saloni oops concept yes java oops see before this before this some environmental concepts first we discussed java environment setup java environment setup next java okay program structure java program structure java syntax okay this is pre setup pre request java environment setup is pre requisite for creating and executing java programs uh, next java fundamentals virat can you list out java fundamentals that we discussed already list out for uh, java first we, uh, we discussed with comments comments comment next then next. data type data types next then variable maintain the sequence before variables one more concept also there in variables we use modifiers Modif- na public int private int like modifiers modifiers next Then variables variables then next. operators operators uh then statements conditional statements conditional Here, and flow loose. control java flow control flow control two types one is conditional statements and loop statements next loop statements next uh, then arrays ah uh, before arrays we discussed string handling next arrays ah uh, next methods before methods we discussed io operations na input and output operations oh file handling one okay file handling is different io operations uh, okay file handling also related to io operations but in this io operations chapter we discussed uh, reading data using input devices okay in uh, io operations and file handling related topics file handling next uh java methods uh one more okay methods methods basically two types na one is built in methods and user defined methods yes built in methods next user defined methods next exception handling we discussed na 
Yes, sir. A exception handling. Anything else? Next, Madhumati, okay. list out Java whoops. Uh, inheritance. Inheritance. Polymorphism. Polymorphism. Abstraction. Just a minute. Polymorphism. Third one is abstraction. And one Last one is encapsulation. 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 And we discussed uh, as part of abstraction, as part of abstraction, we discussed the interfaces also. Okay. These are the required Java programming concepts for our test automation. Just conclusion. Observe uh, Ritesh conclusion. Comments. Is it useful or? Uh, not uh, yes sir. in our test automation useful. useful see useful useful we need to write meaningful comments and I also uh, we also discussed for writing test headers test case headers for writing method headers we use comment syntax and if you if you want to explain the complex logic, suppose you used some complex logic in your test cases. Try to write meaning, uh, try to write comments so that anybody can understand. Comments useful, but comments, writing comments is not mandatory. It is optional, but best practice. Say we write comments in our test cases okay next data types data types mamata data types is it useful or not yes sir it's useful useful see we uh, in our test cases we handle data see as part yes. of testing as part of testing we handle different types of data so that data okay. types required. Next, Pradvi Paul, uh, uh, Ritesh, what about modifiers? Modifiers are useful, sir. Limited use or no use? Why? Say it is used for. It is useful for Java developers due to uh, security reasons. For our okay. test automation, most of the time we use public. public modifier only. Okay, public yeah. is not default, so modifier concept also important. But most of the time, 99%, 100%, we use public only. Why? Our says teamwork we share resources we share we share resources among team members so usual uh, so we don't use private or protected modifiers we use public modifier isn't it yeah okay next yes what um pradhi paul what about variables I think we use sir. we use variables why say yeah. in our test cases we have to store data for store data for later comparisons or for displaying etc we store data in our test cases for that variables required next operators Mamata, what about operators? Sir, it's useful. Useful. See, for mathematical and com mathematical 
comparison and logical operations operators are required yes useful next saloni conditional statements conditional statements saloni useful sir useful where we use conditional statements in our test cases where we use we already discussed that one to insert yes, verification points yes sir to insert verification points and for error handling next supriya loop statements yes sir uh, we use for uh, we use reusability for code reusability not reusability repeated yes, execution yeah repetitive execution repetitive execution reusability is different we use methods for reusability loop statements repetitive execution say for parameterizing test cases we may use loop statements isn't it yes sir next next uh, virat strings strings Yes, sir. We use it in yes, automation. Strings, strings is uh, most useful feature in test cases, automated test cases. Why? Whenever we read data from application object, then computer program considers the data as string type data only. Sometimes we need to use uh, data conversions in order to perform mathematical calculations. String is more useful feature in test automation. Venkat. venkat venkat not responding okay okay venkat ah uh, madhu uh, yes, madhumati i'm here sir pardon ah uh, venkat okay ares venkat ah yeah ares uh, yeah, very important sir very important where we use ares in our test automation um um for uh, we can use it for uh, data types i mean uh, if you want to see or is a... also limited use in test automation in software development arrays more useful but in in our test automation arrays limited use whenever we read data tabular data suppose read excel that time arrays required if you want to read tabular data then we use arrays okay na okay Okay. Next, Madhumati. IO okay. operations, input and output operations. Is it required or not? I think it required. Required. Yes. Yeah. IO operations. We read input. Sometimes we read input using input devices also. Yes. Sir. Next, file handling. Yes, file handling also important. Important. Can you tell me, Ritesh? Uh, when we need to read input, when we read to need input using input devices. See, we can read input from application object. Suppose phone number field is there. I want to read the data. You can read. When we read input. using input devices sir when we need we need the data from directly from user when when it is required okay uh, in selenium test cases chapter you can get more clarity just a brief idea whenever we want to whenever we want to uh enter captcha fields captcha verification code for that we need to read mm -hmm. input dynamic yeah. Yeah, test yeah. data submission say for selenium test cases you can use input direct input suppose username equal to some a b c d direct input in test cases or read input from files data driven testing next for captcha fields we cannot provide di direct input 
why we don't know the captcha before execution after reading the captcha field only you can provide input getting this point respond ritesh uh, yes sir for username password yes. such type of fields you can provide input directly in the test case na yeah true why sir. you know the input you know the input data username password suppose phone number you can provide suppose captcha field is there in our test case you can provide input before the execution no sir no sir, after no. reading the captcha while execution only you can provide so, and how that you can get so, more clarity in writing selenium test cases chapter just remember io operations important file handling also important next what about methods mamata methods built in methods sir built in, yeah useful, useful sir already yes. we use all yes. the built in method uh, uh, suppose system dot out dot print ln that is also built in method built in methods useful user defined methods also useful we reuse our code in our test cases okay na next yes, exception handling exception handling also important is very important next uh, come to this one how oh, is the first prithvi pal singh prithvi pal what about inheritance uh, no use not limited use whenever you want to reuse methods from one class to another you can use inheritance feature limited use polymorphism method overloading and method overriding limited use suppose whenever you want to create method with same names or same method names in super class and sub class that time you can use polymorphism feature polymorphism also limited use next ritesh what about abstraction <laughs> no you here we use all yeah. concrete methods only in our test automation software development it is useful encapsulation mamata what is encaps uh, usage of encapsulation in test automation no use no use say in software development app development developers use encapsulation feature for security reasons uh, but in our test automation no use see this is the usage of java features in our test automation any queries venkat any queries regarding today's class and this conclusion java for selenium no, no queries sir okay good next madhumati madhumati Yes, sir. I'm good. Thank you. Welcome, Mamata. I'm going to close the class, Mamata. I'm going to close the session. Yes, sir. No queries. Yes, sir. No, no queries. Okay, cool. Pradeep Pal Singh. Yes, sir. I'm sir fine, sir. Thank you. Okay, welcome, Ritesh. Uh, no, sir. Okay. I'm good. Thank cool. you. Welcome, Saloni. I'm good, sir. Thank you. Okay, welcome, Supriya. Yes, sir. I'm fine, sir. Thank you. Okay, welcome, Virat. Virat. Yes, sir. I'm good. Thank you. Okay. Okay. We will meet. Uh, thank you. We will meet uh, tomorrow, same time.